So we are just leaving Erwan in Studio City and behind they have this hotel called Sportsman Lodge which like I've never ever heard of until Jerry Duty. have to get you guys onto this thing called eight sleep this is like not even sponsored but it's literally amazing okay so Fran and Josh actually got us I don't know Fran, Fran and Josh Fran and Josh actually got us on that mattress and it's so amazing we just got the topper but essentially the mattress is split down the middle and you can control your own temperature so Kellen runs really hot so he always sets his Sets the temperature are really cool. We call it a tundra. And then I'm like always, always cold. So my side, I set it to warm and you can set automatic timer. So like it'll warm it up right before you get right before you get into bed. And then it'll like warm up right before you get out of bed too. So you can set timers. And like since I breast pump in middle of the night, sometimes it can be kind of cold. So like I make it warmer, but it's literally amazing. And you can control everything on the app on your phone and tracks like your sleep and stuff. I'm just not tracking my sleep, but my sleep is all over the place. I don't need to be seeing those scores. You feel me? Oh, it has this feature too where the mattress like vibrates and wakes you up. So it's really cool. I think it's one of our best wellness investments yet. I think it is kind of pricey, hence investment. But I mean, anything for better sleep, like sign me up for. But it's really been incredible. Like Kelly and I respectively have been going, have been getting better sleep just because there's temperature control now. And let me just show you on the app really quick. Okay, so basically this is the app. Let's just not even, okay, 77, not bad. And you can control it and then you can warm it or cool it. Like I feel like the warmest I've ever done is like four and it gets pretty damn warm and you can make it really cool. So I actually sleep on plus two. Kellen sleeps on negative four, which it's like so cold. Um, There's other stats too. I think I'll be more interested in this later when my sleep is a little better. so happy because you know that means we're getting ready and we're going out looks like i'm full on the way to dinner <laughs> we are headed out for date night this is our first date night in two whole months we were like pretty much at home because kira also just got her vaccine so now we feel comfortable like going out and like being in restaurants prior to that we were like super super safe and we would just keep our masks on so this is our first time just going out us two solo to eat so i'm really excited Whee! how beautiful does she look it's actually so nice to um dress up because i'm literally so frumpy all day at home and whatever I'm wearing, it all ha it always has to be instant boob access for feeding. Yeah, so I've just been looking like a little frump. So it is nice to get dressed up and go out. I'm wearing this super cute dress from For Love and Lemons. I 
got this when I was pregnant but I actually never ended up wearing it but it's like really roomy so I feel like you can just wear it wherever but anyways we're gonna go get sushi which I'm excited about and Get that camera. Fine. You can put it on that stump like that. You know, you see that? It's actually so nice to like dress up and get out of my like nursing bras. And every outfit I wear pretty much has to be easy boob access. I guess this kind of technically is too. But time to get back into my mommy clothes. This is not even front face. This looks actually really cute. Especially because I have my face on and my hair is slicked back, but usually that ain't the case. I've pretty much been living in these like button down blouses. Um, it's either this or like a robe, but I feel like this makes me feel more put together. So, Kira is taking a nap at the moment and today is bath day, so I'm gonna get all her things together. She's actually started to really enjoy baths, which is nice when. She first came home, we were doing little sponge baths because she was like newborn, she couldn't get in water. But once her umbilical cord fell off and it healed, we've been doing bath time and it's so cute. She's really been enjoying it. We call it spa day. <laughs> younger i thought that once you gave birth you entirely lost your belly this is false so right now i'm two months postpartum and like yeah it kind of still looks like i'm like maybe like three or so months pregnant there's still like a like a little bump <laughs> i really haven't been really focused on losing the excess weight because i'm breastfeeding right now and literally it makes you so ravenous like the amount of calories i'm intaking a day it looks like i'm training for something but i think breastfeeding in itself is a freaking sport because you burn like an insane amount of calories it's really <laughs> exhausting um and yeah your caloric intake is a lot so and just my prior at the moment is just like kira growing gaining good weight getting all the good great nutrients so i'm like mm -hmm. at the in and out line right now and I am so hungry and so excited to eat but also I have to tinkle so bad but I'm so thirsty you guys after you deliver your muscles down there just cannot hold the tinkle <laughs> cannot hold the tinkle so 